What? This one made me kind of funny, but it says, D does it float when you guys are in the pool? <laughs> <laughs> no. no? It, well... Hey you guys, it's, it's Addy. Addy. Welcome back to our channel. And as you can see in the title today, I'm gonna be asking Adam, my boyfriend, a dude. A dude. I'm a dude. A guy, a man. Juicy questions that all girls want to know. This is so. There are these questions that you don't know the answer to that you want to know about me. Yeah, yeah. About you and dudes, you know, in general, but whatever. Okay. okay. We did something okay. kind of similar to this. Well, it was called, you know, asking guys questions girls always wanted to ask. But this one is like juicier questions, I guess you can say. Okay. Well, y'all did enjoy those videos so um i guess she came up with this idea i'm down i'm here you know i'm an open book i'm here to answer questions so uh let's get into I it i mean i didn't really make up this idea but i saw videos and the question was like Ooh, i want to know the questions to these answers i mean i want to know the answers to these questions so i wrote them down in my notes <laughs> why do you do this so much you can't do that huh? how do you do it so fast so i wrote down questions in my notes i got about like 19 questions in my notes <laughs> <laughs> okay stop with the hands. i got 19 questions in my notes that i know all girls want to know i know a lot of girls are gonna be like what kind of questions are you talking about but until you hear them you're gonna be like oh i want to know the question i mean i want to know the answer to this so are you ready i'm ready baby i'm gonna be book. The men, I mean, you're I'm gonna answering for all the guys out there, kind of like okay. a, in your opinion. So, okay. without further ado, let's just go into my notes and start asking you these questions. Question number one that I wrote is Can you feel it when you guys run? Feel it as in, you know, as the, in the stuff down there. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. You guys can feel it? Yeah. Do you want to go into further details? Or no? uh, I mean, it's there. Does You're it running. Do you guys when you guys run? Nah. No? Does nah. it like ever hurt? <laughs> no, I don't think it's like. You're probably thinking it's like your tits. When you run, your tits are <laughs> yeah, like. And it might be painful, I guess, if you don't wear a sports bra. But uh, there's no such thing as a bra. Um, so, <laughs> there's nah. There's boxers, right? So, yeah. Trousers, right? Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, most, I don't want to say most guys wear briefs. Because um, there's boxers and there's briefs. You know, briefs are the tighter ones. And it kind of like holds everything there. So, it's like, okay. you feel okay. it, you know. Yeah. But it, <laughs> it's not, it's not like an uncomfortable feeling. So, it doesn't ever hurt? No. All right. No. Okay. Yeah, I guess I thought it was like boobies, but. Second question is, is there a guy version of how girls like gray sweatpants on guys? You know how girls like when you guys wear gray sweatpants? Yeah, there, it's uh, those shorts that you wear. Those. <laughs> I'll throw a picture on the screen. These shorts. Those, those shorts? type of shorts. I don't know. I do you call them booty shorts? I don't I even know if you call them booty like shorts. That. At least that's for me. It's um, just a different type of short. Because it's kind of like a, it's kind of like, God damn, I want to, I want to do it this and that to you. Cheek. Yeah, I'd say that's the closest version to gray sweatpants. In, okay. my, in my opinion, I might not be speaking for all guys right now, but in my opinion, yeah. I think you might speak on all guys for that because I made a TikTok with those shorts on and a lot of people are like, those are the D me down shorts. Yeah, okay, so, then, then yes, okay. those are, um, I didn't okay. even see that, but okay. yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Down to the third question, but like I said, there's 19. All so, right, it's getting juicy, let's go. Third question, does boob size matter or butt size? Again, I can't speak for all guys. Obviously, personality is the main thing as far as anything goes. If you're if you're looking to get in a relationship, I guess overall, you know, if we're not talking about personality, then I would say yes. Well, at least for me, one or the other matters. You know? Okay. I'm a okay. butt guy, but I'm also a boob guy. I used to like mainly be a butt guy, but I'm kind of like a boob guy now. Well, I'm like both. You got nice <laughs> boobs, babe. That's all I'm gonna say, all right? So, um, yeah, I would say it does. It's not like a deal breaker, at least no, not for yeah. me. Um, you know, some guys it's nice might to be, look but... at, but it's not a need, right? Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna speak for you. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just move on. Next all question. Right, next all right. question. How often do you guys think about sex? Again, I can't speak for everyone, but 
It's not like we sit around thinking about sex in particular. I think of it's more, at least for me, it's like I, if I see something, you know? Whether like it's a girl or yeah, the booty shorts or someone on Instagram or wherever um, or in public, you know, then it's like, it's not that we think about like, you know, but we, it's, you know, Start you think about all the stuff you want to do. Yeah. Or you get, you know, it's horny. I don't know. I mean, I feel like that's very, uh, it happens with everyone, you know, it probably happens with girls too. You see a certain sum and you get a little like, you're like, oh. With you, yeah. So you're telling me when you like girls' pictures on booty pics and shit, and you're gonna be like, ooh, I like that, I wanna do stuff to it. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not thinking like, ooh, I like that, I wanna do this, this, and that to her. It's not like that at all. It's more of like, I don't know. Okay, your question was how often do guys think about sex? <laughs> okay. Not, I don't think it's that often. I guess, I mean, it depends on the person. Some people might be hornier than other people. Yeah. But I'm not out here thinking about sex 24-7. Okay. That's all I'm trying to say. Hey, I'm just kidding. That's all I'm trying to say. Question number five. Do you guys look at or check out every girl they see? No. No? Yeah. Which is it? I'd say yeah. But, but not like, babe. We're dating, okay? I don't see girls in public and I'm not thinking like, oh, I want to hit on her, oh, I want to do this to her, whatever, you know? But I think it's just like something that, that guys do, you, you know? You still examine and check it out. Yeah, but you probably examine every guy too. I don't actually. No? No. Out of respect for you, I don't. Okay, it's not like a purpose. I know, babe. It's not like a purpose to try to take people off. It's, it's just, I think it's a genetic thing. I, I don't know. It's a human it's, natural thing. Yeah, it's a thing human to trait. Do, yeah. yeah, exactly. So yeah. it's not like, yeah. yeah it, it ain't like that, but. I know. What? This one made me kind of funny, but it says, D Does it float when you guys are in the pool? <laughs> <laughs> no. It, yeah. well, it, well, what do you mean flow? It's not gonna keep me above water. Well, obviously it's um, not gonna make you. Flow. But yeah, it's not just gonna like hang down. It's definitely like you know. It's wobbling with the flow. Yeah, with the flow of the water. I mean, at least in, in for me, um, I'd like to say I speak for both guys. But um, again, it also depends on what you wear. You know, if you're just wearing swim trunks, no briefs underneath, then yeah. But if you have briefs on, then you yeah. know it, it's probably try to keep it down a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I really wonder what it feels like to be a guy when it comes to stuff like this sometimes. What, like swimming and running yeah. and stuff? Yeah. I think the same about being a girl. Like, what does it feel like to run with, like... It's just... <laughs> You know? He was exactly like that. <laughs> exactly. So like I've always wanted, you know. Can you guys stop a pee midstream? Yeah. Can. <laughs> I can easy. You can. Yeah. If you ha sometimes ever sometimes you have to. Sometimes you. Have okay, to? say you're. I'm gonna sound like a bad influence right now. Say you're pissing in public, <laughs> which is illegal, okay? But you know, everyone's you're a guy. Everyone. Yeah, everyone's done it at least once. And someone comes around the corner, or it's a cop, or I don't know. Um, you gotta like stop, you know. Some guys might not be able to. I think I'm pretty good about being so able to stop. So it's a thing that is mis it a thing that guys can't stop midstream? No, I can. You can. Oh yeah, easy. Okay. I can go so pee right now and show you. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, it ain't that hard. Can okay. girl, girls can? Yeah, we can. Really? So you guys can do this little clenching thing? Yeah. Okay, yeah, we can. At least I can. I don't, I, again, I can't speak for every you guy You know I there. can do that because I'm scared. I don't know if you can do that. I feel like you you can't. You can't stop midstream. Yes, I can. No, you can. I can go pee right now and show you. Babe, I'm yes. pretty sure we've I've gone through I've clenched on your before. I'm scared. <laughs> but that doesn't mean you can't stop midstream. I can. You think you actually could? Yeah, I've done it before, lots of times, every time I pee. That's why we need every to Every time you pee? Yeah. Yeah, I can Girls easily, I mean, sometimes I'm gaming with the boys and like, you know, I'm trying to pee hella quick, you know, but the round's starting, you know, we about to hop in, you know, we about to jump out the bus. And so like, I'm like, all right, I gotta like, gotta, I gotta cut it short a little quick. So I'll finish right. up later. So I'll do half a pee. Bitch, what? So half I'll a go pee? do a game and do the other half of the pee. God. Okay, story. the moral of the question is yes. Okay. Yes. Does the type of hair on a girl matter? Like blondes or brunettes, you know, blah, blah, blah. That's like a type thing. Yeah. It depends on what your type is. For me, no. I think I like brunettes better, but at the same time, I have no idea. I don't think I have like a type as far as hair goes. I've never dated a blonde. Really? Yeah, I've been with a blonde, if you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. But if you know what I mean. <laughs> but I've never, I've never been in a relationship with a blonde, which I never thought about until now. It's kind of odd. Maybe I do have a thing for brunettes, but 
I don't think I do. I don't think I have a type, so. Okay, okay. Question number nine. Do guys get butterflies with girls? Yes. Get nervous, feel all jittery. Down. Yeah, especially yeah. when I was younger. You still get them? Oh, yeah, I guess. But I feel like as you get older, it's more of like a, the butterflies are a little lower. <laughs> if you know what I mean. You know, they're a little, yeah, they're a little yeah. lower, you know? So, uh, <laughs> um, yeah. This one's kind of interesting. Do guys talk about their crush or their, you know, partner or whatever to their families? Uh, yeah. I wouldn't say, I don't know. I've never, like, gossiped about my girlfriends to my mom or dad, but, uh, my brothers, yeah. Just not okay. to, like, my whole family. I don't right. know. I feel like okay. that'd be weird to talk to my dad about that or my mom about that. Interesting. Again, I can't speak for everyone. Maybe you're softer than I am, but um, you're a softy. I'm a soft. I just I, I've never really had those conversations with my parents. All right. Do guys care if girls shave their legs or their armpits? It's a. Uh, I can't. I know I can't speak for all guys on this one because I know some guys probably just don't care at all. You know, because some guys are probably the same. Yeah, I think it's a hygiene thing. Well, it's not only a hygiene thing, you know. Basically, I can't speak for all guys, but me, yes. Yes, I, I do. I prefer a girl to, sh to shave okay. ev everywhere. <laughs> but that's just me. And that's okay. Do you guys ever screenshot our, your conversations and send them to your friends? And no, I've never done that. No? No. Never screenshot? But I know, I no, not conversations, but I've had guy friends like in high school, like homies, screenshot pictures of <laughs> yeah, her face. And then send them to the homies, but like I never did that. Like, I never and I never encouraged that. They screenshot their own pictures. No, no pictures that a girl sent them, and then and send it to the and friends? then share it to the homies, which girls probably do too. If a no, guy, that's... yes, if a guy sends you a dick pic, right? You're in high school. Some guy sends you a dick pic, and you're with your girlfriends or whatever. You're showing them that dick pic. I damn well know who you are. It depends on how you feel about the guy. I guess. Yeah, if you yeah. like this guy, then obviously you're not going to show them what you want. But if this dude's just creepy and like, eh, yeah. you sent me a pic, look. Yeah, yeah, well, it goes both ways, I feel like. Okay. Um, but no, I've never screenshotted conversations I've had with a girl and, and sh showed them to the homies. So. Okay. I just know, yeah, okay. there's no need for All that. Right, yeah. Do guys constantly stalk the girls they are interested in? Yeah. So they have a crush on this girl, yeah. so you just constantly- Again, I feel page. like that goes both ways, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. I didn't know guys would do that too. Go back to her page and stalk it again. Oh yeah, 100%. Trying to see if there's any other dudes hitting on her, or this and that, or who she's following, or- <laughs> Who she's following? You check that too? I think everyone does that. I don't think I'll be- uh, Girls do that too. Yes. Exactly. I do that. Yeah, I know you do that. Do you do that to me? Yeah. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Question number 15. What is the first thing a guy looks at in a picture of a girl? It, it, it depends. Like, what is the pic? Is, is it a selfie? If it's a selfie, here up. There's never just a selfie of here up. <laughs> there is. There is. Really? It, um, it would be, if it was that, it would prop for me, I'm not speaking for everyone, it's probably going to be lips or her eyes. You know, I mean, what else is there to look at her nose no but if yeah if it's a picture of her i mean guilty but i'm sure most guys don't want to admit it yeah the we, titties or the ass. We, probably yeah. probably if it's a picture yeah you yeah. know um i do you know i'm a big fan of lips um so i often check out lips as well but yeah okay does a girl's body count matter to me yeah yeah. Strongly, yeah. Strong. <laughs> yeah. I'll shut you down if your body count is like a certain... If it reached what number? I'm what not going to say what number, but like Just I say, will what? decline you in or, you know, cut you off in the sense of like, you know, not wanting to cuff you because I'm just not, I don't know. It's a, it. it's, a, it's a turn off to me. Yeah. Why? Is that is that something that... Turn me off to? Yeah. Definitely. But I feel like I can't speak for all guys because I know a lot of guys just don't care because their body count's probably a hundred, you know, and, and... Yeah, well yours aren't hundred, so obviously it's it's gonna... Yeah, do I think that's why, because my body count isn't like, you know, that high. Uh, I'm proud of myself, so I have one body count. Yeah, that's good. See, and I like that. I like that. And not saying if you have more than one body count, then uh, 
that I'm not about, but I'm just saying like it kind of just tells you more about that person. Exactly. Right? So. Yeah. Yeah. So for me, and I can't speak for everyone, body count does matter. But okay. yeah. yeah. All right. Question number seventeen. Damn. Seventeen already. Already. I answered that many questions. Through? Do you guys care if she's clean and shaved down there? Well, you kind of answered this a while ago. But... Yeah, but a lot of these are like, I can't speak for everyone. Because some her guys, her. and I know, I know this for a fact because I've talked to dudes, some guys like that. Some guys like, you know, a, a, a lot bush. of a bush. There you go. Me, if you're asking me the question, yes. Yeah. I, I care. I, I want it to be clean. I can't speak for all the girls either, but like I don't like hair down there or anywhere at all either. I feel like hair grows super fast. I can shave tonight and the next morning there's already some prickly hair there. It's <laughs> like, why? I can't. I feel like hair just gives it an extra smell and I don't like that. So it's easier for smell to get caught up on that hair. I see. 18. I like this question. What's the sexiest non-sexual thing a girl does? The sex, the yeah, I get the question. I might have to put some thought into that. Um, sexiest non-sexual thing? Mm -hmm. that a That's a weird sexual. trick question. That's not. Like, what is something a girl does that is non-sexual is, that is sexy to you? Sometimes just the girls laugh. The girls laugh? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Which I guess goes with smile, but that's a weird trick question, you know. It could be like me washing dishes. Or yeah, like, I don't think that's very sexy. Well, you know what I mean. Oh. It's like, it's like when I, and I like to clean, it's like if she I, likes it's clean, it's sexy, whatever. I, don't know, I think uh, yeah, no, I think a girl's depending on what her laugh sounds like and how she looks when she laughs. Um, I think that could be one of them. Or even just a girl who, who I don't know, sometimes a girl playing video games is kind of a turn on. Well, that's not me, so. <laughs> None of that was me. <laughs> what? I don't look cute when I laugh. I don't look yes, cute Yes, lies, when I laugh. baby. Baby, you look very cute when you laugh. I don't like that. I think you look cute when you laugh. You know I always make, make, mimic my own laugh and my voice and I hate it so. No, I think she looks really cute when you laugh okay. and I was thinking of you when I answered that. And uh, I, I don't know, That's a, I, I, I gotta put more thought into that question to answer that. That was a question you've never thought of before, huh? No. That's why I was like, ooh, that's a good question because I've never heard an answer to that question. So I think this is the last question. All right. So the last one is, are guys or most guys scared of commitment? Okay, I'd like to speak for all guys right now. You like Dudes to watching this. Um, if you've been hurt in the past, and yeah, that's pretty self-explanatory. You know, if you've had your heart broken or a girl did this or that to you, to your feelings, whatever, then yeah, they're most likely gonna be scared of commitment in the future. Okay, well I guess that answer it. I mean, it'd be like that, you know? But, but that is the end of the questions. I wish I had more, but if you have more questions that you want him to answer, or if dudes, you have juicy questions you guys want to ask girls, comment them down below or send them to me in my DMs, whatever. Cause these were really juicy questions and I really like these and I enjoy hearing these, you know, answers. So it does your dick flow. Yes, that's or, a great juicy know. question. Interesting. <laughs> hey, you got answers out of me. You know, I yeah. didn't speak for everyone, but I feel like I speak for a lot of guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. So if you guys want to see the opposite of him asking me or me asking more, then comment them down below if you enjoyed it. Smash a like, hit the subscribe button if you're new, click the bell Ding. next to the subscribe button and get notified when Addy uploads a new video. We love you guys, and we will see you guys tomorrow with another video.